sin. Try to understand this analogy first. The sky is limitless, isn't it? But what would happen if somehow it is packed in a big box? However the box is, but it has boundaries, means it is limited and that means as long as the sky is inside the box, it will also be limited even though it is originally limitless. All the rules of the limitations will also be true for the limitless sky because it is inside a limited box now. Same is the case for you. You are originally limitless. But your existence in this world is through the body and that body has limits and physical boundaries. So though you are limitless, but when you enter into this body which is limited, you become limited and all the rules of the limitations become true for you also. Sun. To understand it well, try to understand another analogy. The ocean is so big and has so much water in it. Let's say it has limitless water. If we dig a deep well somewhere, it will also have water. But will that be as much as the water in the ocean? Of course not. The water in the well will be limited, but that in the ocean is limitless. Now what if somehow we connect the well internally with the ocean using some pipes or something? Even though the well will still seem to have limited water, but it will have limitless water. You know how? Because if some amount of water is taken out from the well, then same amount of water will flow into the well from the ocean. So water in the well will be same as that in the ocean. So even inside the limited well, the limited looking water can be actually limitless water. In the same way, even though you are limited in this limited body, but there is a way to be limitless even while being in this body, you have to first realize that you are limitless and then form a connection with the limitless. Many have done this and now we know them as gods, messengers, angels, great saints, great scientists and other great persons. So if you wish to be limitless, even while being in this body, you need to first realize that you are limitless. But it is a bit difficult because right from your birth, you are conditioned to be limited. First the body makes you limited, then parents limit your movements, then society limits you, then your caste limits you, then your religion limits you then your work limits you, then different governments limit you. In this way, whoever and whatever you come in contact with, keep limiting you. All of them condition you to be and to always stay limited. You have to first break these misconceptions and realize that actually you are limitless. Though it is a bit difficult because it is nothing but breaking thousands of dark habits. I will help you here in realizing your limitlessness. Then though limitations of the body will still stay, you will be limitless in every other way and you will be filled with limitless anand and you will experience limitless power and joy within.